Continuing on with strange deaths throughout history, we are between the time period of the Middle Age and Renaissance eras. On July 15, 668, Constans II was assassinated with a bucket according to Theophilus of Edessa. On September 14, 865, Ragnar Lodbrok, semi-legendary Viking leader is said to have been captured by Aella of Northumbria, who had him executed by throwing him into a pit of snakes. On August 29, 886, Basil I, a Byzantine emperor died when his belt was entangled between antlers of a deer during a hunt, and the animal subsequently dragged him for 16 miles through the woods. On May 6, 892, Sigurd, the mighty Earl of Orkney, strapped the head of his defeated foe, Mail Brigd to his horse's saddle. Brigd's teeth rubbed against Sigurd's leg as he rode, causing a fatal infection. On November 30, 1016, Edmund Ironside, an English king was allegedly stabbed whilst on a toilet by an assassin hiding underneath. On October 13, 1131, Crown Prince Philip of France, died while riding through Paris when his horse tripped over a black pig that was running out of a dung heap. On December 1, 1135, Henry I of England, died while visiting relatives, after eating too many lampreys against his physician's advice, causing a pain in his gut, and ultimately his death. On April 1, 1143, John II, Comninos, cut himself with a poisoned arrow during a boar hunt, and subsequently died from an infection. On July 26, 1184, the Erfurt latrine disaster occurred while Henry VI, the King of Germany, was holding an informal assembly at the Petersburg Citadel in Erfurt. The combined weight of the assembled nobles caused the wooden second-story floor of the building to collapse. Most of the nobles fell through into the latrine cesspit below the ground floor, where about 60 of them drowned in liquid excrement. On June 6, 1217, Henry I of Castile, a 13-year-old king of Castile was killed by a tile that fell from a roof. On February 20, 1258, Almustasim, the last Abbasid Caliph of Baghdad, was executed by his Mongol captors by being rolled up in a rug and then trampled by horses. On August 26, 1346, John of Bohemia, had been blind for ten years, and the Bohemian king died in the Battle of Cressy when, at his command, his companions tied their horses' reins to his own and charged. He was slaughtered in the ensuing fight. On January 1, 1387, Charles II of Navarre, known as Charles the Bad, was suffering from illness in old age, and was ordered by his physician to be tightly sewn into a linen sheet soaked in distilled spirits. The highly flammable sheet accidentally caught fire, and Charles later died of his injuries. On February 18, 1478, George Plantagenet, Duke of Clarence, was allegedly executed by drowning in a barrel of Malmsey wine, apparently his own choice once he accepted he was to be killed. On July 8, 1518, several people died of either heart attacks, strokes or exhaustion during a dancing mania that occurred in Strasbourg, Alsace, dubbed the Dancing Plague of 1518. On July 10, 1559, Henry II of France was wounded in the eye by a fragment of the splintered lance of Gabriel Montgomery, despite the efforts of royal surgeons Ambrose Pear and Andreas Vesalius, the court doctors ultimately advocated a wait-and-see strategy, as a result, the king's untreated eye and brain damage led to his death by sepsis ten days later. His death played a significant role in the decline of jousting as a sport, particularly in France. On June 3, 1567, Hans Steininger, died when he broke his neck by tripping over his own beard. The beard, which was 4.5 feet long at the time, was usually kept rolled up in a leather pouch. On August 17, 1571, Marco Antonio Bragadin, a Venetian captain general of Famagusta in Cyprus, was gruesomely killed after the Ottomans took over the city. He was dragged around the walls with sacks of earth and stone on his back, next, he was tied to a chair and hoisted to the yardarm of the Turkish flagship, where he was exposed to the taunts of the sailors. Finally, he was taken to his place of execution in the main square, tied naked to a column, and flayed alive. That concludes our picks of strange deaths from the Middle Age and Renaissance eras. Please like, comment and follow for part 3.